amazing beautiful people and welcome back to another first time reaction video to the one and only Kerry Underwood. Now, this of course is a Judd recommendation. Don't know what that means, Judd is recommending some music he likes. He's a good friend of mine, he live streams regularly on Twitch. Absolute superstar, mega famous guy. Um, love him, he's absolutely wonderful, absolutely sweetheart. If you want to go check out Judd, you can see the link to his channel. There'll be like a thing popping up on it somewhere around the screen and also a link in the description. But anyway... Every now and then, Judd gives me some country music or some, some music from around the world as a recommendation for me to check out and react to on this channel. And this is the next one he's recommended to me to react to. And that is Carrie Underwood, Just a Dream. Now, I feel like I've heard one song by Carrie Underwood. It wasn't on YouTube. It might have been on Twitch as a live reaction. I don't know, a while ago, but I'm not 100% sure. I don't remember. And it definitely wasn't Just a Dream. So this is my genuine first time reaction to Carrie Underwood and Just a Dream. So, I'm going to stop talking. Make sure you guys subscribe so you don't miss out on our channel giveaway. And let's jump into my first time of reaction to Carrie Underwood, Just a Dream. You're still thinking about tomorrow. It's against the rules. What <laughs> rules? Well, I decided that tonight we would just be together, not think about all that stuff. It's just you and me. That's all that matters. It was too. After the day she turned 18 All dressed in white Going to the church that night She had his box of letters In the passenger seat Six pence in a shoe Something borrowed, something blue Absolutely incredible voice already just straight off the beginning absolutely incredible and one thing I love about this kind of music is the picture it creates it really does just tell a beautiful story absolutely incredible voice and when the church doors open up watch you put her veil down trying to hide the tears oh she just couldn't believe it she heard the drum <laughs> hold on hold on one second i thought this was a nice song about a beautiful woman getting married <laughs> is this right i can deal with like a scumbag guy running away leaving like like that 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 won't make me cry that'll just make me angry right that's what i'm saying but the military stuff the military trumpets and him in his uniform is this about a man is it oh man this is gonna make me cry isn't it this is what i think it is this is what I think it is. Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> Carrie Underwood, what an incredible voice, man. What, what, what an amazing storyteller as well. It's about tomorrow. Tomorrow's just another day. The preacher man said, let us bow our heads and pray. Oh, don't do this to me! Lord, please lift his soul and heal this hurt. And then the congregation all stood up and sang. Judd, you're an asshole. <laughs> Come on, man. I'm a softie. I don't, I don't like this. I don't like this. Ah. Ah, come on. Ah, come on. I'm flipping. Ah. <laughs> the thing is, so many people are like, it's just a song. It's just this. The, the problem with all this stuff is all of this stuff draws from true stories and true elements and you know that this has happened to multiple people out there and that image of someone going through this pain is enough to break me. That's why it happens. That's why it happens. As a married man, myself with two beautiful sons, I can't imagine a world where any one of those perfect pieces is not in it. 
That's why. That's why. Carrie Underwood, absolutely incredible voice. Absolutely amazing. And when someone can tell a story as good as this in the, the form of song, you know they've got true talent. But fuck me, man. This is breaking my heart. of like macho -ness I had ended when I started this fucking YouTube channel last year. Oh, come on! Ah, <laughs> oh, man! Ah, oh, man. Like I said, it hits you because you know, you know this story is all too familiar to too many people out there. And it's not fair. It's not fair. No one should ever have to get that knock on the door. life plan for us. It's perfect. I promise. about something else. Carrie Underwood, especially near the end of that song, hit some notes that were absolutely mind-blowingly incredible. What an, what an incredibly talented vocalist. Amazing singer. Fantastic storyteller. Great voice. Everything about this, amazing. Love her voice. Love her sound. Love her. Carrie Underwood, fantastic singer. Really like her. Wanna, I want to hear more from her. Really like her. I really like her. Great singer. Just a dream. Beautiful song. But come on, man! Ah, what a horrible song at the same time. Awful song. Come on. I don't want to, man, I just want to react to funny stuff. <laughs> I just want to react to like, and here is a dancing pig. And it's like, da, 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 that's what I want. I don't want, I don't want this. I don't want, I don't want flipping. I don't want songs like this, man. Ah, but, uh, man, you guys are so mean. Ah, <sighs> oh, come on. Like I said, the problem I have is I have like an overactive imagination. Um, it it delves from like um, some stuff. Don't worry. But anyway, um, yeah, I've got like an overactive imagination, and that causes me to constantly look for like realism in things. Um, so when I listen to songs and they've got like intense lyrics or music videos, that's why that's why I get emotional. That's why I cry. Um, it's because my brain doesn't just look at it as a song or a video or anything like that. Um, it's also why I love horror movies so much because I'm able to immerse myself in the horror movie and get scared. And I like that feeling. Um, <clears throat> but the issue with that is when I listen to a song like this, my mo mind just wanders to all the people that have actually felt this. And I just imagine 
like like my family and not being able to come home to them or just like them not coming home to me you know even my wife it's like the idea of her not being i had i had a moment a few like a year or so ago <clears throat> where um my wife like had finished she worked she used to work in the evenings and she finished work this was a while ago and um usually she calls me on the way home but she didn't call me and it takes a half an hour to get home half an hour passed no call no wife an hour passed no call no wife an hour and a half passed at this point i'm i'm like why hasn't she called me um um so i um oh man (laughs) Oh, it was horrible. I was literally sitting there worried out my mind. So I called the police and I was like, I don't know what's going on. Are there any accidents on the roads or anything I don't know about? They were like, no, no accidents. I was like losing my mind. And I was on the phone to the police and there was a knock at the door. And I opened the door and there's my wife standing there. And uh, and I literally just burst into tears. And I, I told the police person. And I hung up the phone and my wife was confused. And my wife just started crying because I was crying. She didn't know why I was crying. And I just said to her, I was like, what is wrong with you? I was like, just get, why did you call me? And she got a flat tire on the motorway and, and couldn't call me. And I, I, yeah, and it just like, I had all this running from my head and I had, I have two sons and, and I was just like, I, I can't be a dad on my own. How am I going to do this? My wife is super, super mum. How, what am I going to do? And I was just like panicking and I was like, oh my God, I don't know what, like, how, what do I do? What do I say to my children? And like, your mind just starts racing and wondering and, and yeah. And I, I like, that's another example of just like how it works. But yeah, stuff like this just. It just it just sends me there. Oh man, beautiful song. And for anyone who's ever been affected by anything like this, I my heart goes out to you. And I know that's just words, and it doesn't mean crap, but it's all I can say because I can't do anything here. But my heart does go out to you because I can't imagine what it feels like experiencing this. But anyway, I'm gonna end the video there because I'm feeling really emotional now. Uh, Judd, you suck. <laughs> you suck. <laughs> Thank you so much um for watching this video i hope you all enjoyed the reaction i'll leave a link to the original in the description if you want to go watch it yourselves and have a good cry about me <laughs> over here have an amazing day thank you very much for watching and as always my friends you will see me in the next video.